Vaya folclorico. Okay, you guys. So basically, the girls are already inside. They already passed security and all that. I don't know where they're at though. They could be eating or in the bathroom. Right now, I do have to go get my boarding ticket. So let me go do that. <laughs> Okay, you guys, so I finally made it through security. We're done with all of that process, the most stressful part of an airport. You guys, let me know if you guys want to see a full video of me just traveling first class by myself. Let me know if you guys want to see that. Por fin hemos llegado a México. If you guys don't understand what I just said, I basically just said we finally made it to Mexico. So we rented an Airbnb out because, yes, this Airbnb that we rented out for the next couple of days that we're going to be staying here in Mexico is literally making me want to, like, buy and purchase a house here permanently. So, like, I'm going to be giving you guys a tour of our house in Mexico. So I'm so excited, you guys. I literally am trying to talk so slow right now because if I start talking fast, I'm going to get really excited because we're in Mexico. Hello. Also, if I do, also, if I end up talking Spanish or one of the kids ends up talking Spanish, Spanish, just know I will be putting some English subtitles for you guys to understand this, okay? And if you understand Spanish, then you just get an extra laugh, so yeah. <laughs> I also just decided to bring London and Winter with me because the rest of the kids, Isla and James, stayed behind because they want to go do something over there with Granny. I don't know, but whatever. We are currently in Sinaloa, Mexico, and today it's going to be a really chill day. This is our first day here in Mexico, so I'm just going to give you guys a quick little tour of our Airbnb, and then we'll get started with our daily routine. So first things first, this is the outside of our Airbnb. It's gorgeous. And this, you might be like, it looks like a very small house. Actually, it's kind of like a mansion. And this is over $615,000 it took to build. So <laughs> I'm very excited. Let's go inside, shall we? As we go inside, you guys, this like, I don't know if you guys can already tell, but houses in Mexico are very, very different to other places where we normally live. Like in Bloxburg, the houses are like, you know, more modern. But here in Mexico, it's more open air, it's more nature, and I just love it so much. I love coming to Mexico because you just like, if you're feeling stressed, you leave all that stress behind. And over here, you just breathe beautiful air. So in the entrance, which is would be the foyer, here we just have a beautiful big cactus and then two chairs because this is basically like our living room but yeah if you look to your left um this is my room let me show you my room so my room it's very simple obviously i didn't decorate it because it is an airbnb so it's gonna be very basic and bland but you know what it's totally fine here are just some of my luggages for my clothes that i need to unpack from the plane and stuff like that and my bed my beautiful bed of course a house is not a house without a beautiful big mirror so we have a beautiful big mirror here so <laughs> yeah but yeah, this is pretty much it for my room. It's very simple. I love the pink sheets. Also, the sunlight is immaculate in here. Like, ah! Here's one of the bathrooms, which would be my bathroom. Um, It's very basic, very bland. Literally nothing special about it. Besides that, it's in Mexico. So, yeah. I don't know if you guys could already tell, but there is a floor pattern. And uh, I just love it so much. Also, Mexico for me has like a lot of colors. And it's not just white and beige and brown. Like, it's more like colors. Like, as you guys can already tell, like, the roof is orange. I love that. Now, we're going to make into the kitchen, dining room, pool area, activity room, gym room, yada, yada. First things first, you have your little gym area here. Yes, we can still work out in Mexico. They also have beautiful gyms in here. I love it. And then over here is our kitchen. And our kitchen is out in the open air, which is ah, ooh, such a big dream come true for me. And I love it, love it, love it, love it so much. And the owners, the host of the Airbnb, they left us a cute little little note here this is what they said they left us a welcome note with a cake and some seashells that you can actually eat because they're made out of cake like how nice and sweet of them is that and then here is like where we can sit down and eat there is a pool in the middle of the two rooms connecting whatever you guys get it yeah sit here look out into the sunshine and the pool like 
Oh my gosh, so beautiful. And then the girls, they have their own rooms. They're exactly the same though. So this is London's room. She decided to choose this room. Hello, London. Hola, mami, como estas? Hola, mija, como estas? <laughs> but I'm just showing them your room. Don't you love it? I mean, I know it's very simple, but it's an Airbnb. Come on. But like, where are we at? We're in Sinaloa, Mexico. Exactly. I'm so excited to be here. I know. London's a very big fan of Mexico in general. Like, <laughs> you're unpacking your bags? Yeah, I was just here looking, like, just looking where I could put my stuff because there's not nothing really. Well, so. I mean, I know it's very simple, but, like, I mean, we're going to be outside most of the time, so, like. Let's move on to Winter's room now. Hers is literally right there. Um, they were already fighting because um they wanted to like have the same room and I was like literally that's the exact same room, it's just different positions and that's it. But let's go and check up on Winter. Hello Winter, how are you doing? Como estas? Oh what? Winter. <laughs> Winter, you know how to speak Spanish. Well, I don't know why you guys were fighting for the room because literally it's the exact same room, but it looks like you're also unpacking. And let me check your bathroom out. It's literally exactly the same, right? Yep, yep. No, the pintura, the pintura is not the same. The painting, I know, but that literally does not matter because literally if they were to put the same. Yes, it does because mine have a little cute rainbow and London's has an ugly zigzag pattern. Oh, know. wow. But anyways, I'm going to go cook for us to eat our first meal here. A little what? I'm gonna go cook. Okay, whatever. Um, yeah. I'm gonna listen to Piso Plumas. So since we just landed like a few hours ago, like I would say three hours ago, and we've been unpacking and stuff like that, and we've just been chilling, and I personally am hungry. You know, I have not made a carne asada in forever, like forever, ever, ever. Like yeah, in the house we have one, but it's not in Mexico, so it doesn't hit the same. So and lucky for us, our Airbnb has a grill, so we're gonna be cooking some stuff there. I'ma see what should we cook. He decidido hoy que voy a cocinar unos elotes para empezar y ya después vamos a hacer como una carne o a ver qué hacemos. Pero se me antojó unos elotes, so. <gasps> Gosh, they're already fighting. Oh my gosh, this is taking forever. Pero hizo unos elotes. No sé si van a querer unos elotes, pero. No, no queríamos. But I'm also making some ribs with barbecue ribs, so yeah. Maybe we. I don't like barbecues. Well, you can have some elotes, and then later when we go to the fancy restaurants, you can eat something. Okay. Este man. No hay otra pelota de fútbol. No, pero hay una de basketball que la metieron a la piscina. Sí, oh, no la, y no la bueno, ya la comida ya está lista. Vengan a comer. I, I cooked it in the grill, so it tastes extra better. But I made some no, barbecue no, no, ribs no, 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 and some. I made some barbecue ribs and some corn so, on the cob. So yeah, deli, 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 so. Yes, yes, yes. <laughs> Por favor, laven sus platos cuando terminen porque uno siempre está limpi limpi sus cosas. Me dejan todo a mí. Yo soy la que tengo que estar limpiando aquí como si soy su criada. Like, no. Pues si eres mi madre. ¿Y por qué me respondes así? Híjala, ah, Mira, <laughs> Sachikiki, no te podemos estar diciendo esas cosas. <laughs> Look, Winter, what did I just say? Nothing. Now I gotta wash this dish too because apparently <laughs> I am like the maid here. But anyways, uh, yo lave mi plato. London, Hasta make yourself. Man. London, make London and Winter make like lemonade and iced tea. There's some like things for you guys to make there. So yes, a little refresher moment. So yeah. <laughs> Okay, vamos a probar la limonada. Deli, deli, delicioso. Amazing. Uh, mom took what I made and not what you made. Let me try the iced tea now. Ooh, no. Let me see, let me see. Amazing. All right, well, I'm going to go rest for a minute, you guys. So I'll see you guys later, okay? I'm just going to chill in my bed and just, like, watch some TikTok, do some work and stuff like that. It is a little hot, not going to lie. I'm, I'm sweating a little bit. But luckily, there is AC in this room, so that's amazing. And the whole entire house has AC besides the outside. But, yeah, the girls are also going to be chilling in their room. And 
I made some reservations for this restaurant called La Flor, which is basically translated to the flower, like flower restaurant. So I'm really excited. I've seen it on TikTok, so <laughs> we're obviously gonna go there and try out the food. So yeah, um, we'll get ready later. Yeah, I'm gonna go to my bed and I'll see you guys in just a moment. Oh, my back, my back hurts a little bit. <laughs> Alrighty, you guys. So I've been chilling in bed for like two, three hours now, and it's currently 6 p.m. and our reservations are for 7 p.m. So we're gonna start going because it is a 30 minute drive. And I'm just gonna go ahead and retouch my makeup really quickly and redo my hair real quick because I was in bed the whole day, basically. So I'm gonna do that and then, um, yeah, I'll catch you guys at the restaurant. So let's go. London and winter, vamos, ya, ya, sora. I'm here. Okay, Bye. okay. Let's go, London. Okay, we're gonna have to walk or we'll just call like an Uber. We'll see what happens. Okay, guys, so we're here at the floor restaurant and we just got. We've been waiting for like 20 minutes in the waiting room because there's literally so many people that are trying to eat here. I think it's really good. It's five-star restaurant, so that's a good sign. But we just got a table and the way they take us to here is so beautiful. We have to cross like this lake and then they take you on a boat. And then like after you get on this boat, then you make it to the main restaurant. And then right here, we're on... This is like a bridge that takes you to your table, so I'm just really excited. And there's a lot of greenery and birds chirping here and there, yada yada. Okay, let's, let me just show you, and let me stop talking, let me show you how they look. Sit through here, and look, it's so beautiful, isn't it, girls? Like, isn't this restaurant so beautiful? Yeah. Yep, and their raspberries are pink. I know, huh? Right. Like, how good is that? Our table is here and the waitress is about to come in a minute to like, you know, get get our orders and I don't know what I'm gonna order. I'm really excited. Hola, ¿cómo les puedo ayudar hoy? Um, yo quiero una limonada y un pork chops, por favor. ¿Y tú, señorita, con los audífonos? Hola, a mí me puedes dar una orden de chelita. <laughs> Hola, si me puedes dar una orden de chuletas y un té helado, por favor. Sí, chula, eso lo traemos ahora. Y a ti, niña, con los con esas cosas. Porque tú tienes una flor en tu pelo y no se te mira bonito, pero me das una limonada with pork chops. Oh, sí, um, con mucho gusto, ahorita les traigo su orden. All right, let's go ahead and enjoy and devour this delicious food. Girl, no, you don't. It's a song. And I take songs very seriously. Like, what? What is that supposed to mean to you, Camila? I mean, yeah, you don't have no pen Oh my gosh, bottom. you guys. I'm gonna take a beautiful piece of cake. Look at this cake. <gasps> this is more beautiful than I would ever have made. This is so mm, delicious. Cake. Isn't it so good? Oh. Anyways, you guys, that's pretty much it for today's video. I really do hope you guys didn't end up enjoying it. If you did, please consider subscribing. It is totally free. We're so close to 100,000 subscribers. So with your guys' help, literally... We'll get there sooner than expected. But thank you guys so much for watching today's video. I really do hope you guys enjoyed it. Let me know if you guys want to see a day in the life in Mexico with us. Because I will for sure be super duper excited and happy to do that. I love you guys all so much. And we'll see you guys next time. No. No. Bye, Clouds. Bye, Clouds. Bye, Clouds.